Hello friends. Now today we are going to see the next topic from our chapter number six, ten standard is trigonometric identity. How we can make the trigonometric identity easy? Look at here. A one triangle is given. Triangle PQR. In this triangle, angle P is a theta set. So what is the sine ratio for angle theta is? Which is opposite side QR upon PR. Cos theta is PQ upon PR and tan theta is QR upon PQ. Now, by using Pythagoras theorem, for this right angle triangle, we can say that PR square. Is equal to PQ square plus QR square. Now I divide both the side by PR square. So therefore, PR square upon PR square, PQ square upon PR square plus QR square upon PR square. So. PR square upon PR square, which is equal to one. PQ square, PQ upon PR. So PQ upon PR is cos. So here is the square of this cos. So cos square theta plus QR upon PR, which is QR upon PR is sine theta. So sine square theta. We can write it similar in this way. Sine square theta. Plus cos square theta, which is equal to one. So this is the one of identity from the trigonometric angle. Now we want to find out the next another two trigonometric. How we can find out it? So let's see. This is the equation number first. Now I divide both the side by sine square theta. So divide. Equation one by sine square theta. So therefore, sine square theta upon sine square theta plus cos square theta upon sine square theta, which is equal to one upon sine square theta. Sine square theta upon sine square theta is equal to one plus. Cos square theta upon sine square theta. So cos upon sine, we know that it is a cot ratio. So cot square theta and one upon sine is cosine. So therefore, cosine square theta. So in this way, we can calculate our second whose whole identity, trigonometric identity. Now to calculate the third identity, I Divide this equation first by cos square theta. So divide equation one by cos square theta. So look at here sine square theta upon cos square theta plus cos square theta upon cos square theta. Is equal to one upon cos square theta. We know that sine square theta upon cos sine upon cos is tan ratio. So tan square theta plus cos square theta upon cos square theta, which is equal to one. One upon cos square theta is, which is sec square theta. So therefore, we have another useful identity. That is equation number three. So these three identities are very useful to solving the problems, various problems in trigonometry.